My name is Tanya Batts, and I'm a personal trainer with Physique Designs. I want to talk to you about pregnancy exercises for women. What I want you to do, you absolutely want to get medical clearance from your doctor before starting any exercises, especially when you're pregnant. But you do want to remain active. Now, I don't expect you to go into the delivery room with an eight pack, but I do want you to keep your core strong. You want to stand, t stay on your hands under your shoulders, knees under your hips, opposite arm, opposite leg. Just going to keep the low back strong and switch it. Opposite arm, opposite leg. Relaxing the shoulders. And that's a great way to just keep that low back really strong and it keeps the core strong <sighs> throughout your pregnancy and delivery these muscles are really going to help you another great one elbows underneath your shoulders and just slide your knees back and just hold this position kind of takes a little pressure off the back as well now if only if you've been doing abdominal exercises before you got pregnant let's try the next one tuck your toes under lift the knees off the floor this is plank Pretty challenging. You want to keep breathing. And that's just a great way to keep that core strong. Bring the knees down. Another one, kind of want to come down on your back. Only if you haven't reached your fourth month of pregnancy yet. So when you come down, you just want to have either a pillow underneath your head, but just kind of lower one foot down than the other. But you really don't want to lay on your back after you reach your fourth month because there's a vein running along your back called the vena cava. If you depress that vein, it actually cut off oxygen to the brain, which means your baby's not getting oxygen or any blood either. So you just want to be really careful, consult a physician before doing any of these pregnancy exercises.